Additive manufacturing, also known as 3D printing, is the process of creating a physical object from a digital design. Until now, however, AM has unfortunately been limited in terms of size, productivity, variety of materials, and seamless data chain, and has required manual post-processing steps. The Future AM project aims to remove these limitations. Future AM is what we call the Fraunhofer Lighthouse project, where six Fraunhofer institutes are pooling their uh, competencies to improve the whole AM additive manufacturing process chain by a factor of 10. We're six institutes uh, distributed across all Germany, and we try to link the digital workflow that combines the competencies of these institutes via what we call virtual lab, uh, which is a virtual mirror of all the labs that are joint forces here. How is a high-performance component made by Future AM technology? The first step is to design the component. The IAPT in Hamburg has developed special software applications for this purpose, which optimize the component design using multi-physics simulations, generating 3D models suitable for production. The IAPT stores these models in the central virtual lab. From there, IWS in Dresden can access the data and develop the appropriate materials for the component. The scientists at Fraunhofer IWS in Dresden design a tailor-made material system based on the component and its operating conditions. The powder materials are examined in detail before they are processed. By means of directed energy deposition, the researchers managed to realize metallic multi-material components. The manufactured components are characterized using destructive and non-destructive methods. This way, the researchers obtain all relevant characteristic values of the individual materials and the multi-material composites. IWS stores the material data in the central virtual lab. Based on the downloaded CAD data and defined materials, Fraunhofer ILT starts additive manufacturing. Fraunhofer ILT has continued to develop the system technology for directed energy deposition and demonstrated the ALA 3D process. In addition, Fraunhofer ILT has developed a first prototype machine which can produce very large metal components up to 10 times faster. The researchers succeeded in establishing a new machine architecture and optical system for parallelized laser processing. Fraunhofer ILT stores the machine and sensor data of the manufactured component in the virtual lab. In order to identify the physical component beyond any doubt and always be able to trace it, the scientists at Fraunhofer IWU Chemnitz and Dresden incorporate a code in it during production, which they can now read out. It also ensures efficient and trouble-free copy protection. For the subsequent component-specific post-processing, the geometry of the component is recorded by laser scanners and transferred to a 3D model. The optimum processing strategy is derived based on the comparison of target and actual geometry. Processing is carried out automatically by a robot and is then verified by renewed 3D scans. After post-processing at IWU in Dresden, the component is finished. Component-specific data, such as surface condition and actual geometry, is stored in the virtual lab. The transfer of technological progress into industrial practice is one of our core goals at Fraunhofer. Together, the FutureM partners have made a significant leap into a new generation of AM technologies, which are now ready to be transferred. The project outcome is applicable for large companies, but also for small and medium-sized enterprises. And this transfer is already happening right now.